Hey guys, D Monty here with another video on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle Art Edition. So in this video, I'm going to be showing all the art that was sent to me um, throughout the last like couple weeks, um, and just kind of showcasing everything that you guys sent in from my subscribers, from my viewers. So thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate it. Um, thank you for supporting me. Everything that you guys send me supports my channel. So big shout out to you. Thank you, guys. I love you all. Before we begin, I do want to mention that some of the drawings in this video are sent in by professional artists, some are sent in from 12 year olds, and some are just from, you know, your average Joe. So don't don't be too harsh on people uh, in the comments. Uh, be friendly. If, uh, if you guys have a favorite drawing, please let me know down there. Um, as far as dates go, this should be everything uh, that's been shown up until February 12th. As far as stuff that's been sent in, everything... Um, from the last video up until probably February 7th is in this video. I, if it hasn't shown up in a Dokkan video, I haven't, I'm not gonna put it in here yet. I want the, the first premiere to be in that Dokkan video. Uh, anyways, let's get started. Okay, so this is gonna be me doing commentary throughout the, the whole video. Um, I'll call a couple drawings out that I think are really good, but um, for the most part, I'm not gonna say each individual one, uh, except these ones right here. These are probably one of the best ones I've had. Uh, it's all done by the same artist. You can see the shading, the drawings, everything is amazing that this guy does. Um, I actually have him labeled chocolate. He goes by chocolate um, in a folder. So he does a really good job and it's amazing any one of his drawings I would probably put as a tattoo on my body. I actually don't have any tattoos. That's actually been asked in a comment. I don't have any tattoos. Um, so um, during these, I'm actually gonna talk a, lot of, a little bit what's coming to the channel, uh, what's going on, what's new. Now, I try to interact with you guys as much as possible. Um, it's something that I pride myself on, um, as you can probably see by the content that I put out. Um, I make videos on upon requests. Um, I take a lot of fan art in, as you can tell. And I'm actually, I just started a new thing yesterday that I'm gonna talk about right now. I started a new thing yesterday where um, you guys send me your Dokkan, uh, created Dokkan characters. And I, the response has been overwhelming. Thank you guys. Um, I can't wait to show those off. I'm actually having a little problem with it though, believe it or not. Um, I, I was planning, my original plan when I when I talked about it, I didn't think I'd get more than maybe 20 cards. Um, I have gotten a lot more than that. I won't put out a number, but I've gotten a lot more than that. Um, so here's the problem I'm having. You, I wanted to do polls um, on each one so you guys can vote on which cards you like the best uh, on these. I'm gonna be a little bit harder on these. So vote what cards you like the best, uh, and YouTube only lets me add, uh, lets me do polls for five cards at a time. So I was gonna do the the Dokkan art or the Dokkan cards once a week, but it's not gonna work out that way. Um, if I do it once a week, I will never get to everybody's created cards. So what I'm gonna have to do, I'm gonna have to do it more than once a week. I'm sneak thinking two or three times a week. Um, it wouldn't be in place of a Dokkan video. It'd be it would coincide with a Dokkan video, so um, it'd be a double download, uh, like a double day, basically. Usually, I have a set schedule of one video every morning. Uh, so for these, I would probably pre-record them and release them throughout the week. So on a, a few days throughout the week, you will get two videos from me uh, going over the cards that you guys sent me. Um, but I think it's gonna be really cool. I think it's gonna be really fun. It's another way for me to interact with you and for my subscribers to be part of my channel. And uh, yeah, I think it'd be really cool. Um, as of recording this, I just hit 13,200 subscribers. So thank you guys. I really appreciate it. I love all of you. Um, I, I can't tell you enough how much I appreciate your support and all the love that you guys give me. It's a little late at night, so I'm sorry I've had bags under my eyes. Um, what else can I talk about? Uh, my hobbies. I like collecting things, as you can see by the stuff behind me. Um, I have swords. I got a bleach sword up there. I got a Zelda sword right up there. I actually have a bunch of samurai swords on this wall right there. I wonder if I can show that really quick. Oh, come on. And maybe if I just move this down. Yeah. So I. I collect swords, I do. Um, put that back, sorry the camera's shaking there. 
So what else about me? A lot of you guys asked about what I do full time for a job, uh, which I will not disclose in a oops, back a little bit more, which I will not disclose in a video just because I don't want to be stocked at my job. Um, but I do work full time. I work about 10 hours a day. Now the camera's all messed up. Why did I do that? Hold on. I might edit this out. Okay, so I do work 10 hours a day. Um, and then I come home and do YouTube for about three to four hours. I answer comments and then I create my videos. Um, but ultimately my goal with YouTube is I want to be full-time YouTube. I want to do two videos a day instead of just the one I'm currently doing and go part-time at my job to keep insurance for me and my wife. Um, I don't have any kids yet. That's asked a lot too. Do you have kids, D Monty? No, I do not. I do want kids. Um, if you guys have any other personal questions for me, uh, you can ask me in the comments or you can ask me in a Q&A. It's actually probably a probably better thing. Ask me in the Q&A. Um, I have a Q&A in the description of this video and I will probably be answering all those questions, personal questions, if you have personal questions for me, I will be answering all those in that Q&A. Probably at 15 or 20,000 subs. But by the way it's looking right now, 15,000 subs, it's a, it's a good problem. Um, maybe coming too soon where I don't have a enough enough questions yet So it might have to wait until 20,000 subs where I get more questions from you guys um, We'll see how it goes. So if the questions explode uh, Then I if I have enough to you know do a video on a Q&A then I'll do it at 15k But if not, it'll probably wait until 20k So another thing I like to talk about is my favorite YouTube channels um, for the bigger channels, uh, the guys that you might like, you guys might know, uh, of course, Rhyme Style. Who doesn't like watching Rhyme Style? He's a cool guy. Um, ultimately, my goal one day would do be uh, to do a Xenoverse video with him. I think that would be so cool um, just to have a fight with Rhyme Style. It'd be the highlight of my channel, I'll tell you that. Um, other channels I like watch, I like Living Ichigo. I, I feel bad for the guy. He gets a lot of crap, but I enjoy watching his channel. Um, D Free, he's another one that I like. Uh, he doesn't do face cam, but he's done very well for himself. So uh, D Free, I, I love your channel. Uh, you gave me a shout out the other day. I'm hoping one day we can do a collab video together. That would be super cool. Um, maybe even Xenoverse, or we can do Omega Shenron, or uh, what else is there? We can do a summoning video on the, the God Banner coming up soon. Let me know in the comments what you guys like to see. Uh, D free, I'm gonna send you a message probably right after this airs and see if you want to do something soon. Another thing that gets asked to me a lot in the comments uh, that I wanted to go over right now too is uh, how come not more JP content? Demonte, where's the JP content? Um, so I am global main. That's just the way it is. Um, I will be doing some JP content. I have the team to do it. So um, I'll probably do like the Doken events coming forward. Uh, just basically show me beating the events um, and then moving back to global. I want to be probably like 85% global, 90% um, global, and then maybe like 10%, 15% JP. So that's just the way I want to keep it. Uh, JP just doesn't interest me as much. My interest is not there. Being able to read the cards is just um, just better for me. I like I, I like that more. So everybody has their own prefer preference. Um, if they ever added the option in JP to convert to English, then I would probably switch in an instant. Which I don't know why they haven't done that yet. That's actually a great idea. Why do you think they haven't done that yet? Oh, it's because nobody would play global anymore. Right? That's right. Um, what do you guys think about that? Uh, let me know uh, in the comments if you think that's true. But uh, if, if, if JP introduced a English version, basically you can just go to the language and choose English. Uh, would you switch to JP? I would. Even though I have money invested in global, I would switch to JP in an instant. That's just, that would just be way cooler. There's a lot of other channels I enjoy watching. Uh, I'll name a few here. Uh, Animated Muscle. I like Animated Muscle. I like Derp Strats. <laughs> it's a funny guy, man. I like Derp Strats. Um, another channel that I enjoy watching is uh, Fort Misery Gaming. He's a smaller channel, but uh, he tries really hard. You can see the effort that he puts in. Chazi HD, uh, he actually ended up liking my videos and I became good friends with him. That's another thing I love about YouTube is that you can just make relationships with uh, people you didn't even know and it's just, it's it's fun. You, you, you get friends basically across the world <laughs> that you can play video games with. What better, what better friends could you ask for? 
So one last thing I wanted to mention uh, for the channel coming soon is I want to start doing PS4 gameplay. Um, that is coming very soon. I want to do, believe it, I want to do some Xenoverse gameplay with some friends. Uh, maybe Rhyme Style one day. I want to challenge him so bad. You have no idea. Um, I'm sure a lot of people do. So it's just getting on that waiting list, right? Uh, so I want to do some PS4 gameplay, and I want to record uh, South Park, the the fractured butthole coming very soon so i'm actually looking really really looking forward to that game i want to do a complete let's play um it wouldn't go in place of dokkan battle though it would coexist with dokkan battle so it would be like a double upload day as well um just to doing let's plays it would take a lot more editing obviously so i i would probably do like two or three videos of that a week of like maybe 30 45 minutes of gameplay let me know if that's something that you guys are interested in. I am very curious to see what your thoughts, if you want to see me do something like that. Um, we're getting towards the end of this thing, so I wanted to thank you guys for listening listening to me rumble on for like 11, almost 12 minutes. Uh, I really appreciate all of you. Um, I love each and one of you. The YouTube has been a great experience so far for me, and I'm so excited to see what's to, co what's to come. Uh, well, we're still just starting out, baby. <laughs> so we've got a lot more to do. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this, if you like the art, if you want to submit your own art, always in the description below is my email. Um, if you guys enjoyed this, consider giving me a thumbs up. Uh, supports all the artists here. Give them a thumbs up if you enjoy the drawings. And I will catch you all in the next video. Later.